Hello and welcome back to the channel. My name is Caleb and in today's video, I'll be giving you predictions for football matches taking place today, Wednesday, the 28th of August, 2024. I have two sets of predictions for you today with our usual two odds and above. And hopefully at the end of the day, we all will be happy and smiling because we must have maximized our winnings from these predictions. Yesterday, I gave you two sets of predictions, of which we got one out of two correctly. For our set one of yesterday, we had Leicester City versus Charmaine Rovers. That game was from the EFL Cup that took place yesterday, and we went for a home win for Leicester City. And guys, the game ended 4-0 in favor of Leicester City. So it was a controlled win. Leicester City yesterday. Our second game of our set one was Brighton versus Crowley Town. We went for a home win for Brighton and guys Brighton continued their form into the EFL Cup and they won that game four goals to zero against Crowley Town and as such our home win prediction was spot on. The third game of our set one of yesterday was Pata Prague versus Malmo. That game was from the Champions League and we went for a home win or draw for Sparta Prague. So we went for a safer bet yesterday and the game ended 2-0 in favor of Sparta Prague. Sparta Prague are a very, very strong side, especially at home. And they didn't fail to score yesterday. They won that game two goals to zero against Malmo. So they are into the group stages of the Champions League. So guys, these three games actually made up our set one of yesterday and it gave us a two plus odds and we actually won the set. So congratulations to everyone who played from this set one. For our set two of yesterday, we had Galatasaray versus BSC Young Boys. I was really expecting Galatasaray to give this game their all, but guys, Galatasaray didn't turn up very well in this game. BSC Young Boys actually controlled this game, guys. And at the end of the day, BSC Young Boys won that game one goal to zero at the dying minutes of that game. So we went for a home win for Galatasaray in the game and we lost that prediction because Galatasaray could not win against BSC Young Boys yesterday. So they are out of the Champions League. Our second game was Red Bull Salzburg versus Dynamo Kiev. Two teams that can really score goals and both of them scored yesterday. The game ended 1-1 in a draw. But then we went for a home win for RB Salzburg. And guys, despite the fact that they scored first, they could not maintain their lead. And as such, the game ended in a draw. But they still went through because they actually won the first leg. And as such, it was a 3-1 aggregate scoreline for them. These two games made up our set two of yesterday, and it gave us a 2.2 odds, and we lost the set. So guys, those were the two games, those were the two sets of predictions I gave you yesterday. And I want to say congratulations to everyone who played from our set one of yesterday because they actually won. And for those of you who choose to play our set two, I am very, very sorry. It was never my intention that these games would not be in at the end of the day. But then guys, I do my work behind the scenes and the players also have to do their work on the pitch. And so I'm sorry for giving you a prediction that didn't go well, but hopefully I can make it up to you today. So guys, for today, I have two sets of predictions with our usual two odds and above. I have carefully studied these games and bringing them to you with confidence. And hopefully at the end of the day, my work won't go in vain and these players will do their job on the pitch so that we all can be happy at the end of the day. But before I go into the predictions for today, Guys, for those of you who actually tried joining our Telegram group yesterday, 
and didn't succeed because it showed expired link, go back to the comment section. I have updated the link. So you are free to join the Telegram group whenever you want before the link expires, guys. Because when it expires, I'll have to update it again. But then I'll also try to pin the link in the comment section so that it will be easier for you to join through the link. Also on that group, guys, we are actually winning. Yesterday, we also won on the group. So guys, if you lost, if you decided to play our set two on, uh, on YouTube and lost, then on the Telegram group, you should be winning because there in the Telegram group, we play, we play from 1.5 odds upwards, but yesterday was a two plus odds and we won it in our group as well. We have over 80% win ratio in that group. So you, you can feel free, feel free to join the group anytime you want. The link is always there. Once it expires, then I'll update it again. So guys, for today, like I said, I have two sets of predictions for you. For our set one, we have Atletico Madrid versus Espanyol. We will go for a home win for Atletico Madrid in this game. They are in a very good form, guys. And playing this game at home, I really see them dominating the game and actually winning the game at the end of 90 minutes. Espanyol, on the other hand, are not really in good form. They are really, really struggling in the beginning of this La Liga season. But then, guys, hopefully they will pick up sometime in future. But as at this game, I see Atletico Madrid controlling this game and actually winning it comfortably at the end of the day. They are the better side in this one and they have the more quality players. So it's a home win for Atletico Madrid. Our next game is Colchester versus Brentford. We are going for an away win for Brentford. Brentford are a very, very strong side in the Premier League and playing against Colchester, who are in the third tier of the England division. Guys, I really see Brentford overpowering them in this game. I see Brentford controlling this game from start to finish and as such, getting a controlled win in this game at the end of 90 minutes. Brentford is the better side here and they have the more quality players who are ready to pounce on Colchester from minute one right up to minute 90. So I see a comfortable win for Brentford at the end of 90 minutes. So it's going to be an away win for Brentford. Our third game that completes our set one of today is Istanbul BFK versus St. Patrick Athletic. Guys, this game is a tricky game, but we are going for a home win for Istanbul BFK. I really see them winning this one at the end of 90 minutes. This game is from the Conference League, and I see Istanbul going through in this game. It was a draw in their first leg away to St. Patrick Athletic. But guys, coming at home and in the deciding match of this tie, I really see Istanbul putting in the performance in this one and getting a controlled win against St. Patrick Athletic. I really don't see St. Patrick Athletic getting anything at the end of this game. So it's a home win for Istanbul BFK. These three games will make up our set one of today and it gives us a two plus odds. And the code is right there on your screen. For our set two of today, we have Wolverhampton Wanderers versus Burnley. That game is from the EFL Cup, and we are going for a home win for Wolverhampton Wanderers. Guys, from their last two games in the Premier League, Wolverhampton Wanderers have not really been able to win any of them. Yes, they managed to put in the performance against Arsenal. They tried to put in a performance against Chelsea in the first half of that game. But guys, they just fell flat in the second half and it ended in an embarrassing 6-2 defeat for them. Guys, coming back at home, I really don't see Wolverhampton Wanderers compromising in this one. Going up against Burnley, 
they know they are to win this one if they are to kickstart their campaign this season. And as such, guys, just like Everton yesterday, I really see Hoofs winning this one at the end of the day. They will try to use this game as a kickstarter for their season. And as such, we are going for a home win for Hoofs Hampton Wanderers. Despite the fact that they lost their first two games, I believe they have the quality to see this game through 90 minutes. And they have a bet the better players and are the better sides in terms of quality against Burnley, especially playing at home with their home support. So it's a home win for Wolfhampton Wanderers. Our second game of our set two is Cerveza Venza versus Bodo Glim. Cerveza Venza can also be called Resta Be Great. Some apps will have it as Resta Be Great. Some apps will have it as Cerveza Venza. They play against Bodo Glim today in the UEFA Champions League second leg of the final round. Guys, they lost their game 2-1 away to Budo Glim in the first leg. And I really see them putting up a fight in this one, especially at home. They are a very strong side as well. I can say they are two evenly matched sides with Budo Glim being in a very, very good form. But guys, I see a very interesting game in this one with Sevenza Venza actually nicking it at the end of 90 minutes and possibly taking the game to extra time. But then guys, in this game, we are going for a safer bet, which is a home win or draw for Cervenza Venza. So guys, these two games will make up our set two of today and it gives us a 2.1 plus odds. And the code is right there on your screen. So guys, those are two sets of games I have for you today. And hopefully at the end of the day, we all will be happy and smiling because we must have maximized our winnings from these predictions. I have really done my work behind the scenes and hopefully my efforts won't go in vain. Please guys, stay tuned to the channel and don't forget to leave a thumbs up on this video. Hit that subscribe button if you haven't become part of this family yet so that you can join us and, in, and together we all can achieve our goals of why we are here. And guys, once you subscribe, don't forget to turn on the bell notification so that you'll be notified each time a video is uploaded. Please guys, stay tuned to the channel and share the video to as many people as possible. I'll be coming up with more and more videos in the coming days and weeks. Please, guys, stay tuned, and I'll see you in the next one. Thank you.